Now, I want you to clap and sing. I mean, they will give you popular choruses that you know. If you come from the, from the apostolic extraction, you understand what's about to go down. Now, I want you to clap and dance. Clap and dance with so much intensity, with a realization of all these words that have been prophesied on this ground coming to pass in your life. You will not be on the negative side of prophecy. Hey, they don't get it. You will not live life on the negative side of prophecy. Now, are you ready?
Jesus' name, we worship. I say, in Jesus' name, we worship. Lift your hands, everybody. Everybody who has offered a dance, who has offered the fruit of their lips, on this ground, I decree and prophesy over you, every desire that you came on this ground with, it is assented to by heaven in the name of Jesus. No matter how unrealistic, no matter how impossible, by reason of your prayer on this ground, by reason of your dance, your prophetic dance, thanking God in advance for what you want to be done, I prophesy over you that in the next seven days, you begin to see a speedy response to every petition you have offered on this ground in the name of Jesus. If you are believing God for healing in any part of your body, drop your hands. If you are believing God for healing, lift it up. Or you are standing in the gap for somebody. Please, I know this atmosphere looks like fun, but from the incidences we are seeing now, it has become very obvious that some people, I mean, there is, a, there is an occultic gang up that does not want some people to be delivered. So I say it again, please. This is not the time for fun. Don't carry another person's problem. If you are believing God for healing, lift your hands. Or you are stuck for somebody. I remember, let me give you a testimony on this same ground. A lady who had not seen an issue of blood for one year, nine months. On this same, we were here 2021. May, uh, March 12th. On this same ground. Mass 8. One year, nine months, not seen issue of blood. And with her faith, she connected. And she told me, she had gone from UCH, recommended to lawsuits, from Lutz to lawsuits. There's a drug she's supposed to be taking every day. There is an injection she has to be collecting for like six months. And on this ground, she just got angry in her spirit. She took those drugs and buried it on this ground. That no more. And seven days after Mass 8, that blood. If I you know what she did, she used her hand to touch it and snapped it and showed me the hand. Say, my blood is there. On this same ground that you are standing. So please don't, from, if you have been playing this morning, you're joking. From this point, it's serious business. So lift your hands, everybody. You are believing God for healing. Emotional healing. Physical healing of an ailing part of your body. Whether it came by lifestyle, misbehavior, or or he came as an attack of the enemy by whatever way it came I do, I'm not interested I decree you say you sent your word Lord and it he led them and saved them from destruction I decree over you as the word goes out tonight that in the name of Jesus you are healed I say again in the name of Jesus you are healed now take a further step of faith touch that place if you know touch the place if it's not a sensitive part of the body i mean if you understand what i'm saying touch the place i declare that the power that raised jesus from the dead the very life-giving spirit that raised jesus from the grave that made the grave not to be able to contain it at the reason of your touch on that part of your body the life-giving spirit of god flows and it begins to cause the work of healing in the name of Jesus in places where new organs need to be created we provoke the creative miracle of heaven to begin to create new organs I said to begin to create new organs which tree is dead that my father has not planted it has been uprooted I decree on this ground this morning that every tree my father has not planted in your health is removed I say every tree my father has not planted in your health it is removed in the name of Jesus second set of people you know your life has been stagnated for a while you have experienced some form of stagnation you are doing well at a point you just got to a point you hooked you are running a business it was profitable all of a sudden it became losses and your life started going on a downward decline and you are looking at Moshe Maron down Lile Ulua if that is the scenario I described to you, oh, you were once a brilliant student, 
somewhere in between it seems as if you cannot even coordinate anymore you don't even understand what is happening they teach you you have a genuine desire to understand but you just can't understand everything about you is tending and pointing towards negativity lift that hand as i'm sharing testimonies here you will also testify oh. wherever mass is going next year you will come and you will testify so i plan to bring people up for testimony but there's no time we are very conscious of time now lift your hands lift your hands lift your hands lift your hands, lift your hands. the god that changes every garment of reproach for honor the god that changed the garment of reproach of mordecai and made him become royalty overnight the god that took a slave girl called esther and made her to become a queen in the palace i decree over you by the mercy you have found on this ground in the name of jesus your story changes i say in the name of jesus your story changes everything that has become an obstacle a limiting pattern something that has been debilitating against your growth i decree this morning lift up your heads O ye gates be lifted up ye everlasting doors that the king of glory may come in when the king of glory comes every door flings open i decree the king of glory comes into your life in the name of jesus i said the king of glory comes into your life in the name of jesus go and try go and prosper 